Yo, Rory, you know you're going to be needed at some point, right? Just letting you know, buddy. I want to thank everybody for coming out tonight. Give yourselves a, a hearty round of applause. All the bands that play tonight, we're going to rip off at some point during this set, I promise. Please. So check this out. We've been sitting on this record for a year. It's been recorded since last December, last or January this year. It's been completely done. And we've been through all these trials and tribulations to get it out, but it's finally here. And uh, as we're standing here watching all these bands that we've been friends with for years, I realize I've never been the guest of honor at a party. And I'm pretty excited about that, so I'm going to get real weird with it. Uh, I just want to do some sexy dancing. Yeah! Wanna, Stage time. And I just want to have fun with my friends because I think that I'm friends with like 60% of the people here. So thank you all for coming out. Film this place down here and touch sing in your best part. Steal the mic from me. You know the fucking need it. Make sure you jump off this stage at least once, every one of you. Let's cause a ruckus. Somebody say it. Here we go. This is the guy.
before, it's really awesome to be on the show because it's all about friends. Old friends and new friends. We don't really know Hostage Com that well. We just got on Panic Records and we're sharing a label with them. But those guys are awesome. It was awesome for them to come out, break the weather, a city full of bands and we're watching Hometown Heroes in play, so give it up for them. I, I like fell asleep for four hours today. I had to get up at six this morning to go take my test to like officially be a uh, licensed credential substance abuse uh, drug and alcohol counselor. And I nailed it. But here's the deal. Here's the deal. I watched Oak and Bone play, and they're playing some of that new stuff. And it's my job to go tell kids not to smoke weed. But I'm thinking in my head, you know. If, if those dudes are smoking weed and smoking weed's wrong, I don't want to be right. Because that, that just rocks my face. Engineer is a fantastic band who's been around since we've been a band. The singer Bobby has been the bane of my existence since I met him in 2004. Wouldn't have that in a way. Achilles. A couple years ago, put out the most relevant record that the, the Rust Belt has ever seen. It's called Whole Spice. It's about the sixth lost Spice Girl. Give it up for that record, for real. The artistry on that one. I also want to give it up to This Is Hell. Honestly, I hate your guts, but it's only because you're from Long Island. Those fans will be better.
So as long as I got a second to talk, oh, I want to uh, introduce our new bass player too. His name's Mayo. <laughs> you laugh. You know Mayo. Um, well, he joined up and started playing with us about three years ago after our last bass player quit, and he's been in halfway around the world with us. He's put up with more abuse at the hands of us than any human being should have to. And uh, the real nail in the coffin for him was that at every turn. Who said, remember, you're not in the band <laughs> because you've never been on a record with us. Like, you're playing somebody else's songs. And, you know, he'd go weep and fall asleep and then he'd wake up like a new puppy and be reborn again. <laughs> so, this marks the first official show that Mayo has ever played with us. <laughs> officially joined our hooded brotherhood and even though you can't see the hood I guarantee it's there. <laughs>
my thing right now. I know that I'm going to forget somebody, but just off the top of my head, I want to thank Matt Dunn for helping us put this whole thing together. I want to thank Scott Dixon for taking the reins. I know there's a whole bunch of you who are running things here today. Thank you so much. Um, you know, oh, I also want to thank Matt Sincata. That fucking awesome artwork is all him. He's been working for almost over a year. I know some of you have had him as an art teacher. He's a local dude with a whole lot of talent, so go check that stuff out. How many people traveled for this? You guys are awesome. You know, I showed up, I was talking to uh, Joel Capilano. He runs a place called Stronghearts Cafe. It's a big, big cafe in Syracuse for the first of the time. And uh, I was talking to him, and he's like, you know, it's an awesome turnout. I said, yeah, I always show up to these things, and I feel like nobody's going to come. So thank you guys so much for coming. We forget that people actually give a shit about our band. We've clearly checked out the record. It means the world to us because we put everything we had into it. Um, that record is us as people in music, and I think that we did the best job that we possibly could, so it's so awesome to see that you guys like it. Yeah, yeah. Um, I do want to take a second to say that uh, Matt Dunn, for as mixed of a reputation as he has in this town, has been good to us for the last six years that we've been a band. He's always taken care of us, and uh, we had a show booked on January 14th, and he had a conflict with Disembodied, who's coming to town. <laughs> Uh, so we're like, you know, we want to repay the favor and not to book your show. So he was awesome and he put us in this band, Make Do and Mend, on that show. So please come and check us out. February 14th. We're going to be awesome. We're going to be awesome. This is for Rob Butt. Thank you guys for Thank you. 
you so much for coming. Thank you so much for sticking around. This is the last two. This one right here goes out for all that music. That's great. I will say that. I want to give this song out also to uh, Alex and Gable. These are guys that were psyched on our band. They took the time to actually write us a handwritten letter, which you might probably make fun of somebody for doing that, but it's so easy to sit down and write an email. You don't understand how much work goes into doing something like this if you're not a band. So to have somebody else reciprocate by taking the time to let you know that something that you did matter to them, it keeps us going. So to you guys especially, thank you so much for giving a shit about our band. If you haven't touched the stage yet, I'd like to ask you thank you. This song is called I Am the Messiah.
play shitty. Play shitty, That's fine, you play shitty. You won't play! It's fucking shitty! We're gonna get weird with it, dude. Get ugly. Bear with us. This record was recorded a year ago, and maybe six months ago, Scott played this song last. Strikes! 